So it could be that you have a, a SNP at MTHFR. So think of MTHFR as a highway like this. See how there's four lanes? It is an enzyme that's gonna take something and turn it into something. So it's a highway. So depend, other things affect how that enzyme works. For example, the time of day affects traffic. So that's something that has nothing to do with how many lanes are open. It could still be slow. Or if you have construction or an accident, that is definitely gonna slow traffic down. So there's something called epigenetics where you may mm -hmm. have, you may be homozygous or heterozygote, but because of epigenetics things, you can help that enzyme work a little bit better. Or you could even give yourself your body a little detour in your body. So knowing this doesn't mean you're gonna get the disease, but it can help you make the proper lifestyle choices and dietary choices that can optimize your health. So what exactly is methylation? Well, it's just a chemical reaction actually, but it has certain functions in the body. It has to do with genes, it turns them on and off has to do with the conversion of food into energy. So a lot of times people who have MTHFR can have fatigue. It also is involved with making your cell walls in your body. 